I'm Ariel Hicks, and welcome to WITZ, The Wits, the one place for all things music right here in Douglas County, Oregon. This recording is brought to you by 10 Down Bowling and Splits Bar and Grill. Bowling, arcade, outstanding bar and grill. We'd also like to welcome our new sponsor, Edward Jones. Edward Jones offers a personal approach to investing with 18,000 financial advisors ready to support your retirement, education savings, and insurance needs. Gene Bechtel School for Music, bechtelschool.com. Book a lesson, voice, piano, strings, percussion, winds, and brass, accepting students from pre-K to adults. Scholarships now available, apply today. Spider King Studios, spiderkingstudios.com, commercials, recordings, and film. And the Douglas County Music Association, OregonDCMA at gmail.com for scholarships, performance opportunities, and aid for students. If everyone gave a $10, not $100, $10, we would have enough funds to support our community for the next two years. $100 ensures scholarships can be made available. $500 brings students access to instruments and studio space. And $1,000 allows us to support UCC students, UACT, UVAA, and Douglas County Music Education programs. If you or your business would like to consider a sponsorship or donation, please send an email to OregonDCMA at gmail.com or check out our Venmo at OregonDCMA. You can also bring a check made out to the Douglas County Music Association, DCMA, and drop it by or mail it in to the Gene Bechtel School for Music. Thank you for considering giving today. And now some old news. Peace at Homes in Power 2023 Dance and Vocal Performance enjoyed their fundraiser for Peace at Home Advocacy Center. They provide services for survivors of domestic abuse in Douglas County for 40 years. We had two musicians celebrate birthdays. T-Bone Stone and Jason Heald celebrated another 365 days around the sun. Thanks for making music and doing what you do, guys. Keep on rocking. And speaking of rocking, Midnight Roar had their Valentine's Dance senior prom theme. We hope it was a lot of fun. <laughs> All right, and check this out. Can you help Izzy Trinkle and at Sunny Slope Elementary raise $900? Izzy's highly motivated students have a love of learning about instruments and many are inspired by their families to pick up and play. Your donation of any amount, any amount, you can send in a penny, a nickel, anything. Um, it will help these rock stars branch out in Sunny, Sunny Slope Elementary's brand new after school guitar club. You will be helping them learn new repertoire, discover techniques for playing different styles, and experience music as a social program as well as academic study. Afterwards, the instruments will be available for general school population use. Love it! So help them get to that $900 mark. The DCMA scholarship application is now available. So go to our Facebook page, click on files, open the document, fill it out completely to the best of your ability and email it to OregonDCMA at gmail.com or bring it to the Gene Bechtel School for Music. And are you an art vendor, a food vendor, or a community nonprofit? Applications are now open for the 54th Annual Summer Arts Festival. Apply now through April 1st, that's no fooling, for early bird pricing. Celebrate arts, culture, and community right here in Roseburg together on June 23rd, 24th, and 25th. The Umqua Farmer's Market happens every Saturday from 9 to 1 at 1771 West Harvard. Treat yourself to live music, fresh produce, baked goods, along with unique artist creations. Interested in sponsoring Spider King Studios for our 2023 production year? Spider King's brand new 2023 sponsorship form has everything that you need to know in order to get started at multiple different sponsorship levels and many different rewards, ranging from advertisements to exclusive behind the scenes access to all of their projects. Spider King looks forward to working with sponsors and growing their relationships with the amazing community we have here. And don't forget, OBA Roseburg chapter, Bluegrass Jam happens one to four at the Sutherland Senior Center every third Sunday. So that's happening this Sunday on the 19th. All levels are welcome, refreshments are available, and donations are appreciated. 
The third Sunday also has Roseburg Flute Society Song Circle from 6 to 8 p.m. at the Unitarian Universalist Church. Rise Up Singing is the book that they are using currently. Tuesdays at Sunnyside Theater opens their stage from 6 to 10. Thursdays also has Drapers 6 to 10 has an open mic. The second Thursday, so if you want to look on your calendar, it's the 9th of March, is an open mic at Orin Moore Artisan Mead. 5.30 sign up, 6 p.m. show. Bring your music voice, poetry, and good cheer. The third Thursday, which is the 16th, which is what's happening when our broadcast airs, is the Umqua Celtic Jam at Orin Moore Artisan Mead. Bring your instruments and music for a toe tap and good time. But reservations are recommended. And if you want to do reservations, the phone number to contact is 505-310-1525. Third Thursday also has in Myrtle Creek, the Grand Victorian Theater Rockin' from 6 to 8 because they are showcasing the talents of music, comedy, skits, singing, improv, and poetry. All ages are welcome. It's $5 per person. And if you're under 10, <laughs> you get in free. And... Bonus, there's a $15 taco buffet plate, okay? That should get you in. All right, we have Sundays at the Old Time Fiddlers Meeting and Jam every fourth sun Saturday. So that's going to be the 25th, if you're marking your calendars, from noon to 3 at the Sutherland Senior Center, open to both players and listeners. The Community Drum Circle on last Saturdays, which also happens to be the 25th, from 6.30 to 9 at Rio Venue, 1969 Southeast Stevens Street. Bring a percussion instrument and your desire to connect with yourself and others. This circle will be hosted by Nicole Pettengill, focusing on positivity, thankfulness, and healing. And all ages are welcome. It's the last weekend for UX, A Gentleman's Guide to Love and Murder. Gentleman's Guide tells the uproarious story of Monty Navarro, a low-born fellow who, upon learning of his mother's death, finds out he is a distant heir to the family fortune and sets out to jump the line of succession by eliminating the eight unsuspecting relatives, all played by one fearless performer named Z. Who stands in his way? Can he knock off his pesky relatives without being caught and become the ninth Earl of Highhurst? And what of love? Because... Murder is not the only thing on Monty's mind. Tickets are on sale at uact-theater.com or you can go to their, you can dial their number. Yeah, 541-673-2125. Tickets are $15. This production is recommended for those 13 and older, but it is a fun time. All righty, coming up. Colleen Roberts says, hey everyone, I'll be over on the coast performing at Too Shy in Reedsport on Saturday, February 18th. It's this Saturday from 6.30 to 8.30. If you're in the area that weekend, pop in, say hello, and have a beer with us. I'm really looking forward to seeing the new location in Reedsport and spending some time on the coast. Thank you to Shy Brewing for this opportunity. All right, Colleen, I hope you have a wonderful weekend enjoying Reedsport and the coast. A little further along the calendar, an evening of klezmer to classical music as eclectic Andrew Oh, Andrew, your name start, last name starts with an E and you know who you are. Um, it joins the Umqua Chamber Orchestra and the Umqua Singers in concert in the Whipple Fine Arts Center at 7 p.m. on February the 28th. $10 per person, but if you are a student, you get in free. And now our feature presentation. Well, folks, instead of the guest we were going to have, we had a winter storm. Winter storm, thanks for being here. Whoosh, anger, brr, cold. Oof, oof. Uh, I should really stick to behind the scenes stuff, shouldn't I? Anyway, thanks to the winter storm, some folks were stuck and frozen. Because of the winter storm, we couldn't have our originally planned guest on board, so we just wanted to say thank you for stopping by anyway. Uh, we hope you had a very great Valentine's Day, and we will be back to our regularly scheduled program next Thursday. So thank you. And we hope you have a great night. All right, I have to give a special note because right now as we're recording, it is Tuesday, Valentine's Day. And in honoring this day, I wanna give a special shout out to you, our viewers. Whether it's your first time watching or it's your weekly tune in, I wanna say a big thank you from both me and Colin and everybody who works on this. So thank you for tuning in, spread the word, like, subscribe, all that good jazz, please. And thank you so much for watching. 
And that seems to be all the time we have today. Tune in next week for a brand new broadcast featuring Douglas County Arts, Music, and Performance. Once again, this broadcast is brought to you by Ten Down Bowling and Splits Bar and Grill, Edwards Jones, thanks for joining us, the Gene Bechtel School for Music, Spider King Studios, Douglas County Music Association. We appreciate you guys tuning in today. I'm Ariel Hicks, and I'll see you next time, hopefully with my co-host, Colin. <laughs> Bye.